Sweating. I feel like something wants to come out of me. <sighs> ah, I had to go to the supermarket because there was nothing much at home. I needed Pepe and some other things. <sighs> Let me see that first. I'll come back again to my channel, guys. Ah, it's not easy at all. In fact, I can't wait to be done with this baby because climbing this step. With this load and my leg, it wasn't easy at all. Ah. Oh my god. <sighs> Guys, I have to go to the supermarket because the things I bought from the African store is not that much. I ordered um, another thing from another African shop. So those ones, I was expecting to bring it to me yesterday. But they message me that there is holiday tomorrow from tomorrow till Monday, so they can't bring it till next week Tuesday. And I could not wait because I needed some things at home. The yam I bought safe. I only cooked half. The many half was spoiled, so I had to throw it away. So yeah. So I ordered um goat meat from this shop. I ordered goat meat. I ordered um pomo and some other things. So I needed pepper at home, uh, not um, spicy pepper, just normal pepper, like bell pepper and the long one. And I wanted to buy the canned tomato bowl. I don't know, I've been working in the supermarket, I did not even find so. I did not want to stress myself too much because if my doctor should see all this waka waka there, she will flog me with cane. <laughs> because that woman, she's always telling me, lie down in bed, lie down in bed, lie down in bed, but... There is no one to help. What will I do? I cannot just lie down in bed. When I have this, my guy here, it's not possible. So, even for the past two weeks, she was like, ah, she don't know if we are going to make it for like a few more weeks. We should just hope. And I know we are going to make it because upon all the stress I am doing, nothing is happening. So, this baby is not even ready to come, I guess. But I just always feel pressure, like the baby is putting pressure on me, but then nothing happened. So, the last time I went to her, she told me uh, my cervix has gotten a little bit shorter and the baby's head is closed. If you know where the baby's head is, eh? the baby's head is like in my, the, this thing go go, <laughs> the down part. Even if I am walking or if I'm standing, I am feeling it so badly. But still, we are still progressing. We have just a few more weeks to go. So once this month ends ends now, the first week of next month, I think they're going to remove this cyclage. So after then, I am going to overstress myself because this baby, eh, we are just saying the baby might come early, the baby might come early. The baby might end up coming very late because with Malik, Malik came late, even though Malik came down so early. Malik still came late to almost 41 weeks. So once they remove this cyclage, I'm going to like walk and walk a lot because I'm not even sure if like if they don't break my water, I'm not sure it's going to break itself. So I don't know, but at least 38 weeks, I'm getting this baby out. I'm not waiting till like 39 or 40 weeks. Once we eat 38 weeks or if probably 37, I don't mind. So once this month ends now, it's just maybe two more weeks to deliver the baby and we are done like i can't just wait so anyway guys um i bought some things because there was no like things at home that malik could actually eat especially things like um, nuggets so i went to buy nuggets because of malik if not for malik i would not have gone out today really because because of malik so these are the things i bought and um, I saw this one in the supermarket, so it's just like, I don't know if it is crab, I don't know, I just bought it, it's just to fry and eat it, so. Wait, wait. I don't even know if this one is the cooked one, because there are some that is already cooked, it just goes to my gravy. Okay, this one is not yet cooked, my liquid wait. And I bought egg, most importantly, because of my 
I got two eggs and then this Malik always eats this. I got some noodles and uh, this for Malik too. And this is the second egg. I got this for the toilet and this for the toilet as well. No, this is for this is I think is for cleaning kitchen yeah and tables. I got some like when they turn tomatoes or mini tomatoes. <laughs> ah oh my god. The baby is kicking me so bad. Like this baby. This one is Jackie Chan baby. Because Malik did not kick me as much as this. Like I'm always feeling the kick so much. Sometimes I'm like, does this baby not sleep at all? So this one is for the toilet. I noticed that Jamal, they don't really wash toilets, they only clean it. And they clean the floor. They don't wash like wash, wash like that. So I got this meat, one kg. This is already the sliced one. So at least it's still much than the ones we buy that is already already packed in the plastic. So it's like seven euro, eight euro, and it's not even much. But this one, I think for one kg, it's still manageable. Although it's eleven euro. So um, I think meat is kind of expensive in Germany, but the cheapest is pork meat, and we don't eat pork meat, so this one is uh, ring flesh. So this is the one we bought. I'm going to use this to cook, um, I think I'll fry stew today. <sighs> so, I'm so tired, eh? And I got um, toothpaste for myself, this tomato. Oof, I'm having contractions. <laughs> yeah. Oh. And I got this toothpaste for my leg. <laughs> I'm not to bend down when this baby is already so so down. The baby is too low in my belly. I cannot even pick this thing. <laughs> Yeah, so I got this toothpaste for Malik. So I'll just make this for Malik now so I can eat because I have not eaten anything since morning and it's past 12. So I'll make this for him and I'll end this vlog here. I'll be continuing this vlog later. So I don't know if I'll be I don't know if I'll be continuing it with um the cooking and everything. But we'll see how it goes. I'll just end this vlog here and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.